Na from Kukwala High School, Yolanda Sodat says she's lucky to be alive. She felt sick during her English metric exam paper yesterday. This after eating crumbed porridge with alleged expired sour milk. She said she vomited blood and had to be rushed to hospital. I'm a bit worried because of I didn't uh, finish my section C while I was writing English paper. And I'm also worried that uh, it may affect me to fail the paper. And also, and other, other great tough learners are also affected because it was not only me. And yeah, there's nothing else that I can say. But the, the, the nutrition, the nutrition, those people who were involved in nutrition, they should take, um, take a lead on what, ha what happened to the, to the food that we ate yesterday. Over 1,000 other learners were rushed to hospitals in Bisho and King Williamstown after suffering from vomiting and diarrhea. Angry parents say the quality of food given to their children is a cause for concern. We were very happy when government decided to provide meals for our children at school because some of them come from poor homes. But now that this has happened, we are not happy because some of our children were very sick when we arrived. Provincial Health Department says they do inspect the food before it is distributed to schools. But the common denominator in this incidence is mass which means that the dairy, we have already sent people to take samples and look at the dairy. But the dairy, this one in King Williams Dam, takes from Stetterham. We've also sent environmental officers to the one in Stetterham so that we should do tests. We're also doing test samples. We've taken samples of the water. Eastern Cape Premier Pumulo Maswale visited some of the learners at hospitals. He admitted that this incident calls for even tighter measures to be put in place. Going forward, it's going to be strengthening uh, the assessments done before uh, even visits to some of our suppliers uh, because uh, nutrition is one of those uh, uh, lifeline things to support uh, education. And in this instance, uh, there must have been an encroachment in one of the items for which, uh, upon validation, uh, appropriate actions will be done. The Department of Education says it's to make special arrangements for grade 12 learners who are affected to write the exams. Lerato Tipa, SABC News, Bisho.